Hi, this is Jeff, and in this screencast, I'm going to show you how to create an interactive screenshot in Articulate Presenter uh, based on the word of mouth blog uh, story that came out uh, two days ago. Uh, they showed this really cool interactive screenshot and how you can build in a storyline. So, this, this is basically what it looks like you've got your screenshot uh, of a software program and you can click on it and it zooms in on certain sections so it's really cool uh, and in storyline really simple to build basically what you do is you uh, let me go to storyline you create the slide and you create a layer for every specific thing so these are images with animations on top of them so in Articulate Presenter, we don't have this kind of layering, but we can rebuild this using hidden slides. Um, so let's jump to PowerPoint. And this is what it, what it will look like. Basically, I've got my main screen here. I've got my uh, question marks that are hyperlinked to new slides, or basically, uh, which basically is a duplicate of the main slide uh, with a transparent shape on top of it. So that's this thing. Um, and then I put in the image and I create a callout box and I put a hyperlink back on the uh, transparent slide as well as on the, on the closing mark and that hyperlinks back to the main slide. On these images I put some animations, a zoom animation like it did in the uh, storyline feature and a fade animation on the text box and I set these to after previous so they appear after each other. And I basically do the same thing for the other slides, as you can see. Now, another thing that I'll do is I'll go to Slide Properties, and in Slide Properties, I'll uh, set Advanced by User, and Navigation, uh, I set the slide to Hidden. So I right-click it, and I say Hide in Navigation Panel. Because I want to do this in in, in full screen, I also changed the, the view for all these slides to, uh, to, to slide only. And I see I accidentally locked that slide, so I don't want to do that. And that's it. So when I publish this, I'll get this. Now that looks quite familiar. Uh, and as you can see, I've got my uh, uh, question marks here, and when I click it, it does exactly what I would expect to do. And it's the same uh, animation and the same look and feel as you would get in Storyline. So that's how easy it is to rebuild this uh, uh, interaction in, in, uh, in Articulate Presenter using uh, mostly a PowerPoint features. Uh, hope that helps. See you later.